<sighs> all right it's the dawn and i'm back on my dad this another video for y'all and um today we're trying something new um i've always wanted to do this but you know i get nervous in front of the camera sometimes and especially when i'm by myself it's um it'd be nerve-wracking it took me three tries just to get ready to make this video and um this i'm starting a new segment um hopefully um we're gonna call it shower talk i think i think that's what we're gonna call it shower talk and um basically i'm just gonna sit here and just talk about a topic and then it's up to you if you want to listen or not you know i hope you want to listen because you know i'm i'm dead down i make i make some good points and um that's just basically what it is um See the, see the design? It didn't really come out the way I wanted it to, but it's a work in progress, so that's that's just how it is. And, um, basically, let's just get into it. Um, today's Easter, so happy Easter, y'all. Um, I took a shower, like, 15 minutes ago. And in the shower, I was really thinking, like, I was really just, I was in, I was in touch with my, with myself, um, my other self, Philosopher Dawn. Um, if you have me on Snapchat, you know what I'm talking about. Um, but I was just really in my feelings. Like, you guys know that I design stuff that has to do around, like, hearts and, like, love and stuff. But, and then I was just really thinking, like, love is like really overrated and i literally wrote that in my notes like love is just so overrated you could put all your efforts into trying to 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 talk to somebody or be with somebody and then they just don't like accept it well it's not like they don't accept it. it's just like they just don't care like they just don't realize like what you're doing and it's low-key irritating too it was, it was really irritating and um i was just in my shower in the shower and um it's just, I was just thinking, like, that's just so irritating. Like, it's just, it's just irritating. Like, you could literally put all your efforts into somebody, and then they just not care or realize, and then you're just left here and dry, like, okay. Okay, like, I guess you just don't care. And, um, I was just thinking about, like, like situations that I've been in, you know, where that's happening. It's just, like, I'm, I'm dead Don, you know, and even if, let's, let's not even just say I'm dead Don, I'm Donovan Jackson, you know, I'm just, I'm just that nigga, you know, and for me to pursue you and put effort into trying to be with you is just, you should appreciate it, like, like, I understand if you don't like me, you know, that's understandable, but if you do like me, and, you know, I'm trying to pursue you, and then you're just, you know, you're just not putting in even the effort then it's just like what am i doing i'm wasting my time trying to pursue you if you're just not gonna like do anything like this is just a waste it's a waste it's a waste of time what are we doing i could be go looking for someone else or you could be looking for someone else it's just like it's just it's just dumb it's just really dumb and um most of it's just like a lack of communication like first of all communication is big communication is key like that's just like up there at the top if you don't have communication you don't have anything basically and um like people just make it so hard to communicate when it's really not it's not hard to communicate not at, it's not hard at all it's really not hard to communicate and like people pick and choose when to communicate when you should just do it all the time you shouldn't pick specific points in time to communicate. I mean, you can just do it all the time. It's not hard. Trust me. I know. It's not hard. It's not hard to communicate. You can communicate pretty much anything and everything. Like, it's not hard. And people just make it so hard. It's not hard. It's not hard at all. You say you... T okay, the most... The okay, let me, let me figure out what I was saying. The hardest part about communicating is probably trying to get your feelings across so that they understand. But at least make an effort for to try and help them understand. Like if you don't try and help them understand then then basically you're just doing nothing. Like you're just doing nothing. You're just leaving them in the dark. People can't read minds. 
I can't read your mind, you can't read my mind. And it's your job to help me understand. I hate when people, do, like, they try and communicate, but then they don't help you to understand. Like, it's two of us, you know. Help me understand what you're feeling or what you're saying. And, um, what was I saying? Yeah, but it's like, you should help me try and understand. Like, especially if I'm putting in effort and I want to understand, then it's your job to help, to try and help me understand. You get what I'm saying? You get what I'm saying? It makes sense. Like, help me understand. Help me help you, basically. That's what it is. Help me help you. Help us. And, um, people just make it so hard to, communi to communicate. And I hate when, like, when, say, if I'm communicating with you, and I'm telling you something that you're doing wrong. And you, ch and then you just try and like flip it back and make it seem like I'm the bad person for, for trying to tell you, you know, what the problem is. And I swear, I, I hated that. I used to hate trying to confront people because they would flip it back on me. First of all, I don't like to confront people. I don't like to tell them what they're doing wrong. I don't, well, let's say I didn't used to. I didn't like used to doing that because first of all, I hate confrontation. I used to hate confrontation and um i've gotten better with it but the reason why i didn't like it is because i was afraid to lose people you, know, you get what i'm saying like if you're afraid to lose people then it's like you don't you don't want to confront them because you might lose them and i've gotten over that now i'll confront somebody and be like you know what you're doing this wrong this wrong this wrong this wrong and like with me i'm i'm a simp i'm a romantic I, I want to make things work, you know? I don't want to lose that person. You know, I don't want to have to drop them off or just drop that person off. Like, I don't want to have to do that. That's... To put in all the time and effort and then for it to just fall apart is just... It's irritating. And it's like, dang, I just wasted all this time for this person and then, you know, it's not about to work out. And... I forgot where I was going. What was I talking about? Um, I honestly just don't know what happened. But let's 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 just take it back from the top. Okay, so if I'm communicating with you, oh, that's what it was. Like the person tries to flip it on you and make it seem like you're a bad person for confronting them about what they're doing wrong. I hate that. That's totally manipulative. I think I said that right. But yeah, I hate that. Totally manipulative, and like it just it makes you not want to confront somebody because they're just gonna flip it back on you for trying to tell them what the problem is which they shouldn't do they should they should they should accept the points that you're making and want to do better that's what it is they should want to do better because if you're telling somebody what they're doing wrong and they are not trying to listen or anything then it's like what if we're, we're wasting time you're not trying to help us you're just trying to be defensive and so that right there is just that's dead this trash throw it out the window like that whole situation is just over because you can't be with somebody who's not willing to to change or you can't even like let's not even say be with somebody you can't try and talk to someone who's not willing to change to help you guys like do better and stuff and then it's just a waste of time like first of all nobody wants to waste time wasting time is is pointless Okay, why would you want to waste time? You only get one life. One, you want to live your best life, right? And so, wasting time is just like, it's just dumb. It's just pointless. Oh, yeah. Put yourself first. That is the, first of all, you should love yourself more than anybody else should love you. At the end of the day. The only person who should love you more than yourself is your mom because you know, she birthed you. But anybody else... You should love yourself more than anybody else. If someone else loves you more than you love yourself, then there is obviously something wrong. You should, you should love yourself and you should put yourself first because putting other people first, ninety percent no, I'm 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 gonna, I'm gonna drop down. Seventy five percent of the time doesn't work. It doesn't work. You could put somebody first. You could, you could text them first. You could do everything first, and then, and then they just not reciprocating. You get what I'm saying? Like, if you're doing everything first and then they're not putting in effort to reciprocate what you're doing, then it's like, it's a waste. It's a waste. Like, it's a waste. You know, they should be putting in just as much effort as you are to make this 
friend. It don't matter if it's a relationship. It don't matter if it's a friendship. It could be both. It could be one or the other. But if they're not putting in as much effort as you are, then what's going on? No, there's a... For the most part, there's always one person that's putting in more effort than someone else. That's probably true for everything. And, um... It's pretty sad that that there's not people out there. Well, you, so where, where do I want to go with this? You can get lucky with finding someone who. Let's see, how do I want to say this? If you find someone else that puts in the same amount of effort as you do, then you're you're lucky because then you're like you're like the minority against the majority because the majority of them don't. Majority of friendships and relationships, both people don't put in effort. But if you're the minority, that means both of you guys put in equal effort, and then basically you're you're good. Like this this right here is set. This right here needs to get where this is. You get what I'm saying? And um, basically what I'm saying is put yourself first. You should love yourself more than anybody else, besides your mom. But you should love yourself more. Like, first of all, there's there's people out here who don't love themselves. And I honestly be feeling bad. Like, how do you not love yourself? You're you. And if you and if there's something you don't like about yourself, then try and fix it. And if you can't fix it, then I don't know what to say then. But you should, if, if there's something that you don't like about yourself, then you should be able to fix it. You should be able to fix it. You should be able to fix it because it's you. If you don't like something you're doing, then change it. Like I be, I really be feeling bad for people who just don't, who just don't love themselves. Like, like how do you not love yourself? You you. You should love yourself before. First of all, you should love yourself before anybody else loves you. Period. At the end of the day, you should love yourself. You're you. Like, for you not to love yourself is just bizarre. It's, it's crazy. But um, yeah. May put yourself first because putting other people first, it just for for let's 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 use me an example. I put people first. Okay, I'm not gonna say I put every person first, but I I put you know specific people first, and um, it's like like I said, I'm romantic. I'm a simp. You know, I'm all that. Matched in one. For, for the most part, okay. There, there are some times when I'm not a simp, you know. I'm not romantic. I'm pretty, pretty heartless, pretty cold. But for the most part, I'm romantic. I'm a simp. You know, that's just me. But yeah, I put people first, and then like it'll it'll start off well. You know, they like the effort that I put in. You know, it'll start for the most part. It'll start off well, and then if it doesn't, then you just on to the next one. You know, keep it pushing. But then it just, it just like where, it just goes to where it's like, I'm still putting in a whole lot of effort. And then you're not putting in as much effort as you used to, or, or you're not putting in as much effort at all. And it's just like, why? Why did you stop giving so much effort? Like, like, did I do something wrong? You know, did I do something wrong? And then it has me like second guessing myself, like, dang. Now, you know, they're not putting as much effort in, and, you know, this, this and that, and then it just, it just leaves you second-guessing yourself and feeling bad because it's like, what did, what did I do wrong? And for the most part, you didn't do nothing wrong. It's just them. They just, they just stopped putting in the effort, and they, for their own reasons, and then it's just like, that's just how it is, like, and then you have to, like, confront them and be like you know oh like prime example say say you text somebody say say you've been talking to somebody for a while right you put in a lot of effort they put in a lot of effort then you know as time goes on they're putting in less effort less effort here less effort here less effort here and then get to the point where you text them right and then y'all having a conversation they don't text you back right for a for a whole okay say say this has gone been going on for a while like you you will text them and then they won't text you back and then you you will text them again and then they'll then they'll text you or something and then it's like 
well, what have you been doing this? And say, like, the time period is, like, a day. Say you text him and then they don't, they don't text back for a full day and then you text him. Be like, you know, what's going on? You know, hey, what you, what you doing? And they'll just be like, or like, you don't even have to say what you're doing. You just send them a text message like, good morning or something. And they'll be like, oh, good morning and stuff. Then you'd be like, you know, you've been doing this, you've been doing this over for, 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 you know, some time and stuff. And it's like, what you've been doing this for this whole day that you haven't texted me and stuff. Like, you don't have to say that. But it's like, that's what's going through your mind. Like, you don't text me back, but I text you, then I double text you, then you want to text me back. And then that stuff is just irritating. Like, it's irritating. You shouldn't, first of all, you shouldn't have to put up with that at all. Period. Period. You shouldn't have to put up with someone not texting you back or someone not putting in effort. Like, that's just dead. Dead. She's dead. You can go find someone else and then they'll put in hopefully they'll put in effort and stuff and then you'll be straight and then they'll have to deal with losing you because first of all if you're a good person then then you're like you're you're a good person like people really i tweeted this like like actually yesterday i tweeted this and said let's let's see if i could actually quote myself um i'm pretty sure i said people don't realize what Oh, people don't realize how good they have something until they lose it. That's exactly what I said. And um, that is really an actual factor. Like, people really don't realize all the good stuff they have, like, or, like, the good person that they have until they lose it. And then they're like, oh, dang, he was a good person, you know? I should have I should have stuck with that, you know? And um, that's their own fault. At the end of the day, I was putting in effort, or, like, say you're putting in effort, and then they're they're just whatever and then they lose you and then it's like now they're all sad and stuff but it's your fault when i was here putting in effort and stuff and that's just on them i don't know what it was like dust but yeah that's just on them and so you know i'm pretty sure that's it pretty sure don't really have anything else to say but um yeah what did I say? Oh, yeah. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Um, I hope you liked the video. And that's pretty much it.